Hello geocachers, it's Symbol here and we're out in the countryside at Arley um, that's uh, in England, United Kingdom and it's a nice um, country village as we wait for the muggles to disappear off to the horizon we've uh, come and we found a couple of seats here to sit on, look the beeper's gone round here, if I zoom out the cache is on there somewhere but I just want to show the views before we get it and wait for those uh, muggles to go you can just see them in blue just about there they're closer than they look on the camera and this is uh, Arley, Arley village uh, this is the River Severn and um, you got the Seven Valley Railway up there there's little um, Arley uh, station there. There's a bridge going across here so I've walked across here to get to it and as you can see there's lots of little dogs and oh, all flapping their flapping their wings. And there's a couple of um, doggles and then there's some muggles. So it's quite busy because it's quite a nice day now. Looks like somebody's got a, a hall there with, to go um, canoeing. They're putting, uh, putting it together. Must be a collapsible one. Anyway, shall we go find this cache? Because it's a really good one. I'm going to give it a favourite. But from here, you can sneakily um, go around the bench and fingertip search. But uh, I'll show you. The clue is Bolt and it's on the bench, the Arley bench. Should we go for it? It's good isn't it? It looks like it's a blow up, um, let's do it, <laughs> it's a blow up uh, boat. And they've got the oars down there, well that's great isn't it, they're going to go down the river. Anyway, let's find it. I was fascinated with that, I didn't know they had them inf inflatable um, dinghies on the River Severn. It's probably one of these bolts, there's loads of them look. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, and then there's another bench to the other side. Six, seven, so there's eight benches there, and then there's some of these either side. I've put my fingers in there to see if it's a magnetic one. But actually, if I put it here, you might be able to see it. So I zoom in. Can you see anything? Zoom in a bit more. Set of focus because it's focusing on the. There, you saw it there. Let's close in and go, go and see what's down there. It's a bit more shiny than the rest and a bit bigger, a bit different shape. Uh, there you are, look. Isn't that good? Got to watch the nettles going down here. Isn't that good? I'll just sneak that because you've guessed it, this muggles. Just coming up. We we'll wait till they've gone. And uh, let's have a look at them uh, putting the boat together. It's a good scene, isn't it? Inflatable, um, oh, actually, they're inflatable canoes. I can actually see the reflection in the, the viewfinder that the muggles behind me have just gone past. But we'll have to give them a bit more time. I can see what she's got in her hand. She's got um, one of those pumps, foot pumps. All the, all the little um, ducks are really fascinated. There's a little muggle. D dog toggle, sorry. A little doggle. I think it's, it's safe. But just have a look around. There they go off into the distance. The muggles have gone now. About um, nearly 100 metres away. So let's put this... Um, Let's put this back, let's, um, 
just have a look at it first. Zoom out so you can see it. Look. They put a, a metal uh, bison in there. You can unscrew that. Unscrew that and then um, probably need some tweezers to sign the log. Um, there we are. But that's a good thing. I actually use nails, but look, they've used a, a tough pick. So that's a good, good idea. So you can actually just grab it with your fingers. I'm going to just put that back now and uh, pu push it back into its, doing its one-handed. It's a bit more dip tricky. Uh, just sign the log. If you've never done geocaching before, um, just join geocaching.com. You can uh, do a lot of them for free. There's some more coming. So, we'll just have a look. So a quick look, where they are. Yeah, it's going to take about two minutes. Anyway, we, at least we can see how they're getting on with this boat. Look how many ducks there are. Uh, they're starting to pump it up. They've got a pump each. Yeah, it's inflating. There's going to be two um, two canoes. What? That's really good. Let's zoom out and have a look at the whole scene now. Actually, somebody's actually got the um, two canoes there as well. So they've got two canoes there and two inflatables. It's not a beautiful sight. This is the good thing about geocaching. It takes you to lovely areas like this. Um, quick look. There you are. Then. As long as they don't look back, we should be all right. Just sneak it back in. Isn't that good though? I'm going to give that a favourite. Go back into its little hole. Nobody will guess, even if they're saying, oh, why is he playing with the... And you've got some camo here as well, look. That's it. That's really cool. Good. It's hidden now. Okay, there we are. We're at uh, Arley. Um, I'm not sure if that's in Worcestershire. We're on the border of Worcestershire and um, and uh, uh, Shropshire. And this is Arley Village. And then I'm going up to Arley Arboretum now to collect some more. Back over the bridge, along here, and then up, up there somewhere. So I'll meet you there. And uh, happy geocaching, everyone. It's a lovely summer's day. Get out and... Get those caches. Bye for now.